So today is the first day I'm going to open my bank account. Now, I was supposed to do it last year, and it didn't end up happening, but then quarantine also got in the way after that. But, obviously, I don't look like I'm ready, but we're going to go there today. But first, uh, let's get changed real quick. Alrighty, we are back. I have my dress shirt on. I have my hair done, my teeth brushed. I have some uh, uh, dress pants. And all I need to do is find a tie. But before we do that, let's like do some movie magic of me getting there to the bank. Because, you know, just, just go already. Thank you. Thank you. And you can, you can uh, yeah, okay, well, shoot, yeah, it's birthday, same month then. Um, I'm hoping this group. Is that accurate? Let's see. Talk to the check into the account, that check ends up bouncing, there's a $4 fee for that, but I've done that. Basically, yes. Our account is good all the way up until he's 19. Yeah. Once he turns 19, it'll automatically, automatically convert into a regular checking account. <laughs> His, uh, his limits will go up once he, one, if he converts it to a college account or if he converts it to a, check a regular checking account. But for now, the ATM limit is 5 to checking wallet so basically what we're going to be doing is reading through a few of these to show you guys what you get out of a high school checking account that you can open when you turn 13 years of age number one you have a balance of $500 you can draw from an ATM unless it's a chase ATM now when you use a normal ATM they charge three dollars and chase themselves charge two dollars and fifty cents leading you up to five dollars you can check your account balance with the chase app and going to chase himself you can make deposits you can make deposit slip and you can receive checks but you just can't write them now it's a little weird how it's called a checking account but you can't write checks you can manage account alerts you can uh, adjust your settings through an app you can get a debit card which is currently on its way it takes about seven business days but if you express it it takes two business days now let's talk about the money aspect of having a bank account I can open an online business storefront if I wanted to and I can use that debit account to get direct deposits from YouTube if I end up getting paid or from companies that I online sell with or I can get direct deposited from customers I can use apps such as Square or Cash App as long as I have a debit card Cash App is a little different you need to be 18 years or older but I'm sure there's a way to get past it. You go to open a bank account with Chase, it's called a high school banking account. So if you are going to ask your parents to open a bank account and you're under the age of 19, it is a high school banking account. 
There are absolutely zero monthly fees that come with this card and this account. So normal accounts usually get charged $25 every single month, but when it comes to the high school card, you have a total due every month of $0. Obviously, uh, I can't go through every single page because I already had to sign these inside of Chase and it has some personal information. But that's pretty much all you need to know. Bank opening a bank account takes around 30 to 45 minutes. It's pretty simple and fun. And once you get to know your way around earning money online or uh, doing things that require a debit card once you get older, this is a good way to start. So it's not a savings account, it's not a normal checking account, it's just a high school checking account, but you can't write checks. That's it for today's video, see you guys in the next one.